you brought up God before, and before like we try to move off this topic, I just wanted to say, just not to like kind of breathe in good thoughts into your way, but these kids came into your life, and I guarantee you there's no money in the world that could replace these two gentlemen that are next to you. No, oh, facts. So when the money gets put in front of you and your heart's telling you no, remember God could move faster and stronger than any money in the world could be offered to you. So whatever your heart's telling you to do, never let it move. And I know you say you move with wherever your audience is going, but sometimes the world kind of whispers the wrong thoughts. Even your audience does. Really listen to your heart. I'm very proud of you, dude. And I really am. I'm very, very proud of you. Wait, so you believe in God because he got you subscribers? <laughs> no, I believe in God because of just what he's done in my life. I he mean, got you subscribers? Not even that. No, it's just <laughs> I was in a very dark place. Like, I did not know where I was going to go. Like, I was stuck. I was, I was like neck deep in mud and I got pulled out and I give all praises to him because I feel like whenever I don't put him first, that's when the most shit in my life happens. And it's so easy when like everything is going good. It's a blessing you could see that, bro. That's yeah. such a blessing you could see. You don't that. think you had anything to do with pulling yourself out of the mud? There's only so much you can do. There's some things like I'm pretty sure even in your career, you're just like, how did I do this? You know, the, 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 human, the human body and mind can only do so much. There's some things where it's just like, there's some situations that just happen. It's just, it can't be by chance. It can't just be, you know, coincidental. Like, it's like, you know, whatever your higher power is in life, that's up to you to believe. But there's just moments in our lives where we all have to sit back and be, wow, how did this happen? How am I in this situation? How am I gonna, how did I get out of this place where I thought I was gonna be trapped forever? And in my personal view, I just give all praises to the most high because I feel like he's the one that does get me out of those situations. Retroactively, I totally, I totally get what you're saying. I can definitely look, look back and go, how did that possibly happen? On paper, that was impossible. But I always am a little fearful of placing my, my belief and hope in the future in in something external for me it comes from here i want to do something i'm going to go get it done sure i'll manifest sure i'll put the good energy out there that's you know my version of of god the universe good energy karmic energy mm -hmm. um and, and and we all have a different thing but i i i don't love i don't love the reliance on something that i'm not sure about but you say you say reliance and stuff but like even in the bible it doesn't say if you believe in me you're gonna get all the best things in the world you're gonna it actually says if you believe in him you're gonna get you might get the most persecuted you might uh come out the least yeah come out the least mm -hmm. in the situation so uh, you know who he is bro logan Paul. king saul king saul he's king saul bro when i see you, i always think of king saul logan saul are you just, what are you, what are you going on? <laughs> it's a big ad lib day for my, yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, King Saul, basically how I see you is bro, like you, you get it done, but you're, you're not, ho hopefully you don't take this the wrong way. Your pride and ego will blind you from the higher power. Honestly, fuck you, bro. <laughs> it, it will blind you from the higher power. You want to put it on you. And dude, I watch, I watch, and I tell you this all the time. I go, there's going to be a day where you do come and you're like going to see it. But I'll say this to anybody because they always come up to me because I talk about Jesus all the time. They go, how can I see Jesus? I go, the day you want to see Jesus, that's when you're going to see Jesus. You just don't want to see him right hold now. Hold on, hold on. I would love to see him. Present thyself. Oof. Imagine somebody Where, just popped up. And be, by the way, careful, I pray. Be careful how you say that because remember how he presents himself might not be how you want him to present himself. It could be you in a coma. All right, let's 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 calm things down. Everybody, just relax for a second here, right? We're in this rich mahogany. No, studio. but I'm everybody, saying, well, I, be careful what you pray for, facts. bro. Because listen, if there is a higher power, hypothetically, bro, you could bring in your knees real quick. Hold I on was, a second. Hold on. A second. Why does it have to be malicious? Because, all I'm saying, bro, like, if there's let's a go grab power, a coffee. Because like, sometimes, yourself, when bro, you, like, like sometimes it might have to be malicious. Because you know, I've been there though. No, but what I'm saying is sometimes. We have to be at our lowest to be the most receptive to things. I've been there, bro. I had fucking throw up, piss, chocolate milk, sweat, blood, and acid oozing out of my veins at Burning Man. I looked at myself in the, in the mirror and I was, I was like, this is, I'm pathetic. I'm a shell of myself. Where was Jesus then? No, can I, can why, I, why I say something? Around can I, hanging with the devil, can I say something from, from someone who has also been through a thing or two? The heart, you, you say you don't like to rely on a, a third party thing Essential. an external factor right you want to rely on what's inside you and that's that's the same thing i relied on when i got off heroin you know what i'm saying and when i crawled out of the fucking gutters of hell right but i found out very quickly that that heart and soul that i rely on was put there by someone mm -hmm. 
So you can rely on your heart. You can rely on your soul, but just understand how it got there. I know. And I understand know. who's right. infusing that You're right. with... I, 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 I also want to, you know I, what I'm saying? hundred percent. I also yeah. want to say I'm, I'm being facetious no, I know. In, in providing a viewpoint. Yeah, I pray, I pray, dude. Can Every I, single night I pray. Yeah. You know, I'm, I wouldn't uh, 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 label myself as being under a certain discipline of religion, yeah. but I believe in God and I pray. Go. Okay, um, just a quick question. You in the back. Have you ever read the Bible? Uh, I, I, if there was some sort of audio book, yeah. I so definitely just, still wouldn't listen to it. If your father, God forbid, far from here, uh, ever passed away and he wrote you a journal and if you wrote your journal God dang for talking scenarios. to you my dad writing a journl yeah. he's in a coma see the how dad is it <laughs> like, I mean bro can you just use it more relaxed is anyone can... in my family still alive in your scenario <laughs> right. can my dad stubbed his toe let's say his dad stubbed his he... toe alright go ahead so my dad's limping now so he's stopped. limping and he okay he goes off into a journey right he's he's not he's alive he's he's living his dreams okay. but he's off on a journey you guys can't really communicate he leaves you a journal of like hey man this is how i think you should kind of see me as if you don't ever want to pick it up and read it you don't want anything to do with him so you say present yourself he presented himself you just choose not to uh, see it. No, I'm joking. I'm, 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 bro. Every time I, I counterpoint, you go, I'm joking. I because I'm being hey, facetious. I am being George facetious. George is really mad today. Because, because <laughs> I, the, is God has lip? played a, a very big part in my <laughs> life. I, I just don't know if I see it the way that you see it. That's because, okay, okay. Right when we were here and we were talking about what we were doing, everybody was doing their thing last night. What was I doing? You were kicking your feet up, laying on your stomach, reading the Holy Bible. At night, when I'm in London. And the reason why is because and Mike I was having do a threesome. And I well, do turn down the money. And I do walk away from situations. is because I am a part of it as so much in my life that I could look at situations and be like, ah, oh, I could see him everywhere I go. I Every know. single situation but do you I go, walk But you go to me. church? You don't got time for church. <laughs> okay, so. Devil's avocado. Like, you know. I mean, I don't want to like, because I, I, I hate spewing like my putting my I, I don't want to put my uh my viewpoints and my religious views on other people i just like i like to like do it as where i like i like call it planting a seed where i just say something and then like you know it'll take over from there on out and you stuff get like redwoods that. from them seeds you plant the right seeds you can get some big trees <laughs> this is impulsive oh, okay. <laughs> but like like you saying like you don't believe in stuff like that it, i was so confused on that but like, like, <laughs> I'm like, like, you had me, you had me stumped there for a second, dude. He's spazzing today. <laughs> I saw the confusion. <laughs> you plant the right seeds. The, but like, what I was like, basically, what I was saying is like, you know, I don't take offense. Like, you know, you saying you don't believe in stuff like that because, like, you know, everybody believes in their own thing, you know. And then you have people like that believe in other religions. You know, I'm not gonna tell someone what to believe in, but all I know is whenever I have a platform, I just put the most high first because. That's just how you're living. what I want to give. Yeah. That's just what I want to put out first. Would you identify as Christian? Uh, yeah, yeah. 